All right. Ah, oh, man. Sorry. Okay, now here we go. We're on the boss fight of uh, against Dr. Fetus. It is hard as fuck. I'm trying the best. Oh, this could be too close. Oh god, nine! Thank god this guy can't aim for shit. Actually, he can aim pretty well, but if you hide behind a wall like this, he's gonna miss you. And no, despite his appearance here, Dr. Fetus is not a playable character in the game in any way. However, I heard there's a developer mode or something where you can play as him. And his rocket launcher actually works. I have not played him though, but I have seen videos of it. I don't think a rocket launcher could be used for anything though. I wish I could blast these stupid saws out of the way, that's for sure. Whoa! Nine! Oh, how the frowl do you get through that chamber? And guys, uh, if this, if I can't beat him in this video, I will just go on practicing this level for a few days until I'm certain I can I can show you the ending, which obviously is not gonna be the real ending, but you know what I mean. Shoot me, you bastard! It's an interesting type of boss level, actually. There is uh, many different ones. There was a race with Brownie. There was a pattern memorization one with Little Horn. And this is more or less a remake of the original boss fight, Little Slugger. The difference is Little Slugger was a joke compared to this. I r remember him? I beat him in the first video of his Let's Play. This is the same. Dr. Fetus chases you through the level. You gotta bypass a bunch of saw blades and don't die, which I keep doing. I really don't plan on it. But like I said, little, little slugger was a joke. I heard there was actually people, you know, when I read the Steam forums and stuff, they say little slugger was too hard for them. Um, if I think I if I show people like that this video, they will shit their pants. I don't mean to insult these. I just find it funny that uh, that little slugger is considered to be a hard boss. It is not by any means. And uh, why do I always screw up that jump? It is only challenging when you started the game. Really, practice it a little, and you will get it. This one. You definitely are not gonna beat it on first try. No way in hell. But again and again, I'm amazed by the soundtrack of this of this um, of this game. It's really good for an indie game. It, it, it has amazing quality. I think I figured out how to go past that. But figuring out and actually doing it are two different things. Uh oh. Really, I don't get it. Am I just supposed to fall through that? I don't know. It's not apparent to me. And I, I think if I fall down, I'll just fall into the damn spikes. Or no, or saws or whatever. I really don't. Oh, what was that? Was that fraps? If it was, whatever. Let's just try to beat this bitch. We didn't come this far to give up now, didn't we? Oh my lord. 
Five minutes, I'm already on this damn level, and I'm nowhere cl close to beating it. You know what this reminds me of, difficulty-wise? Castlevania. Dracula used to be the hardest boss I've ever seen. In pff, almost all the games. But here... Oh, God. This is harder, I would think. Maybe not as hard as the original Castlevania. That took me, I don't know how many tries to beat it, and I used save states. So, yeah, I was evil. Okay, so I, su I am supposed to fall down there, alright. It does not make it a lot easier, though. I only have a millisecond to get away from there again. What sick fuck designed this level? Whoever it is, he doesn't like me. Apparently. Other Let's Players have said it before, Team Beat hates their playbase. And sometimes... It sure feels like that. That was close. Fraps, what are you doing? Let me play. Fraps! Oh god, frames are fucking... What the hell? Hang on. Is this better? I hope so. I think Meepo was glitching there for a second. I went through that one wall, it didn't help me though. I think I saw that before in someone else's Let's Play, that they glitched through walls if Fraps was fucking up. Really, I do not intend to use Fraps for, uh, for cheating. That'd be the last thing I wanted to do. I want to beat this legit. No fucking around. No glitching through walls or shit like that. We're gonna do this. Oh, fuck. How do you time that right? I wish I could push Dr. Fetus into one of these damn saws. It would serve him right after the millions of them he sent me through. Oh, and anyone curious enough, I think my death count is by now over 6,000. I don't know if that's good or bad. I just know it has gone down a little lately. Oh god! That actually worked! Damn it! Alright. Oh god, what do I do? What do I do? I had no idea what to do. That's a bad thing. I have never played this boss fight. In any new situation I'm confronted with, I have to react. However, I don't always know how to. That's a problem. Fraps! Jesus Christ. Guys, um... I have six minutes, six and a half minutes on my clock. On my watch or whatever. I'm not sure if... I... I'm afraid this needs some more training. Unless I pull a miracle out of my ass. Surely not like that. So, um... Yeah, this is the hardest level so far. Pretty sure. I swear if my frames wouldn't fuck up every time I need them. What is going on? Stupid ass PC. Oh, fuck. Frames! It doesn't even make sense. I have more than enough uh, space left. Tons of gigabytes for recording, so what's the deal? I'm not even focused anymore. I play like shit. Fuck did that hit me? We 
fraps usually does not cause issues for me, but... Hmm. So far, so good. I landed right on the motherfucking saw. I couldn't beat this level if my life would depend on it, I swear. Wouldn't that be a sick idea for a horror movie? Unlike Saw, where you have uh, traps, let people play a game, like a really hard game, and say you can, you, you'll can survive if you beat this level. You're not allowed to die, though, so you have one try. If you fuck up, you are dead. I swear. Games like this are so hard, you couldn't beat them if your life would depend on it. I'm surprised that idea has never been used in a movie before. As some anonymous uh, movie director is watching this and he wants to pick up the idea, give, at least give me some credit, dude. Yeah, Super Meat Boy in Saw 9. It sure as hell has enough souls. Fuck. I know I'm talking random shit right now, but I really have no idea what else I should do. This level is kicking my ass. And... Huh. I have somewhat of a strategy. It works until the halfway point. At least I would think this is the halfway point. Because I don't see the exit anywhere. And I died again. And there's no other way. This is one path you gotta follow. And if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. And it's back to the beginning. And you got to try all over again. And, uh, in case there is some people who don't believe me, I am trying as hard as I can. I may have made some of the earlier chapters look relatively easy, but trust me, they weren't. Not when I started playing, anyway. And, um, I said it earlier, I want to beat this game. It's my number one game on my list right now that I want to beat. And I will not stop until it's done. And even if that means I have to wait for a few days with the next episode so I can train this a little bit. Because I will need training, I can tell. I'm not getting, an, uh, that, not getting that far. I don't see how another 50 minute episode should, would change anything at this point because this pattern is just all over the place. I die from the same fucking bus saw every single time and I don't know what to do about it. Other than trying over and over and over again. Oh god, I'm late here. Oh, maybe not. How will... Uh, I'm losing focus. It's that simple. I've been playing the same level for so long. I'm not getting anywhere. I'm getting frustrated. I don't know what to say anymore. Other than... Good lord. So, I'm sorry. It looks like we're not gonna see the end of a day here. This is my final attempt because the time will be up. So, if the clock rings, ignore it. I'll go over time. A few seconds don't harm. I want to beat this. Now. And if I shall not beat it, I'll beat it next time. Yeah, next time. See ya guys, I will train.